our patient was Justine Wise, and she had end stage macular degeneration that uh, the retina surgeons had said there was no further treatment for, and so she was left with uh, dark smudges of vision in the center of her vision in both eyes. I could not see anything close up. I couldn't see to read. I couldn't see to read my bills. I couldn't see to write a check. And per uh, the peripheral on my left eye was good, but my right eye was nothing. So I had no central vision in either eye. Now she has an implantable telescope in her right eye and the magnification on that is about 2.7x and that will be used for central vision. So hopefully she will achieve a minimum of two to three lines of vision better than she had before the surgery in that right eye and that will be able to um, uh, do things like recognize faces, write checks, um, distinguish colors, be able to see family members around her. Her left eye will be used for peripheral vision and she had already had a cataract removed in that eye with an implant put in. So one eye will be so for central vision and one eye will be for peripheral vision. Well, it was very exciting. It was our first procedure. Uh, the OR staff was very well planned for it. We had great nursing and support system. Everyone was there and ready to go last Friday morning. The procedure went off great. There were no intraoperative complications. Postoperatively, she looks great. Her pressure is fine. Her wound is healing nicely. She's already reporting some visual improvement, and we have not even begun her occupational th training that she has ahead of her. This is a new procedure. Um, it requires a large wound. Our traditional cataract surgery that we do today is what's called sutureless cataract surgery. 15 to 20 minute procedure, very small wound in units of measurement. It would be a 1.8 to a 2.2 unit incision. Her incision required a 12 millimeter incision, very large. Uh, it was um, it was an extensive wound that required a lot of suturing. The telescope was very delicate. When we do cataract surgery now, we put in an implant to focus the light afterwards. And this telescope was like putting in five to seven of those implants at one time. So it was very large and very heavy and had to be supported in the human eye. And things went off great. I'm seeing some with both eyes. I'm very satisfied and hopeful. And you need family to surround you and help you through it. Because without them, you can't do it. You need the, the drive yourself, but you need the family help.